Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. You're watching the great, great, great series of Arduino tutorial. And if you have not seen the previous video, I have given the link in the description below. And if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon. So I have wrote, I have published a book on Arduino. On the link for it is in the description below. I'm not asking for donation. Instead, please support me by purchasing that book and support me. The title of the book is Arduino Robotics Arduino for Kids Cradle to Program. Uh, it is only the first volume. It is available in uh, Google Play, Google Play Store. I have only wrote the volume one. I wish to write more volumes covering all the programs of Arduino. So, in the 19th tutorial, we have seen that at how to control the servo motor uh, using potentiometer. But and today's tutorial is the continuation of the 19th tutorial. That is, I'll be control same. I'll be controlling the servo motor using potentiometer but the angle of the servo motor will be displayed on the LCD so let's program it now let me explain the program first hashtag include servo dot h that is we are uh, including the libraries for in, including from the libraries for servo motor and hashtag include y dot h h for the the LCD and hashtag include liquid crystal L underscore underscore I square C dot H and this is the library to this is a now here we are as here also we are including libraries which we have downloaded uh, downloaded from Google Chrome next liquid crystal underscore I square C my LCD. This is as you know, we are creating object from the um, library and 0x27 is the address for my uh, LCD display and 16 comma 2 there are that is there are 16 character length and two rows. Next in so open is pin is six. Next in pot pin equal to a zero and int servo post is 0 and int pot 1 l next servo my servo that is we are creating the object for servo as well next void setup my servo dot attach that is we are attaching the library we are attaching the servo next my lcd dot begin that is we are beginning the lcd next void loop port 12 equal to analog read port pin that is port 12 we have declared a variable uh, that that's actually a empty variable now our port pin from port pin will get some data so put that data into the port val variable next serial dot print port val equal to that will be displayed on the serial monitor next serial dot print ln port val next float y equal to 255.0 slash 1023.0 into port val and float x equal to 180.0 divided by 1023.0 into port val the in a previous in, in the 19 tutorial we have only used this because we don't want to we don't want to see the we are, we was not declare showing the angle well, this first line only it it converts it map it maps analog read to analog write that is so potentiometer to servo motor but this over here uh, float x equal to this why i'm you taking a 180 is that my servo motor the maximum uh, degree it goes up to is 180 and the digital uh, sorry analog read so analog read i'm converting into degrees into port well next my lcd dot set cursor zero 
comma zero that is i am setting a cursor location where it should be it should the lcd should print now as my lcd dot print enter open bracket angle is that is as print the angle first print in the zeroth column and the zeroth row print angle is next at zeroth in a zeroth column first row print x that is the degree which that is the degree which writes which uh, the servo motor writes next my servo dot write y delay 500 500 that is delay for 500 milliseconds so let's compile it compiling yeah done compiling now sorry now uploading it uploading uploading yeah done uploading now just a second i'll just adjust the camera see over here when i vary the potentiometer sorry the, when i turn the potentiometer the servo motor is in, the portion of the servo motor is changed and the angle the angle is 75.66 now see here the angle is 10, 110.50 and 32 is showing because the servo motor the knob might be lit slightly might be it turned see now it is around uh, now it is standard of for one 110.50 so this is the output see here now i am wearing the potentiometer the saw mode is also been changed and the angle is changed it is 6.745 degree now it is 120.88 now it is 36.604 now let me explain the uh, circuit of uh, i square c as you know the ground and vcc e pin will go to plus 5 and ground and and serial in the previous video i forgot to tell that serial clock is in arduino serial clock pin is a5 and serial data is a4 these two pins can be used as a analog read as well as these two pins As well as these two pins can be used as analog read, analog read as well as this uh, serial serial clock and serial data. Guys, you you might notice that I have attached two mini breadboards and a no board with a single board. It is actually acrylic two mm board. This is the board which I got for one dollar uh, by doing this is the work is getting more easier and it also saves our time energy and in every case the number of small connecting wires will be more than the bigger wires so by this you can save the bigger wires for doing some new projects and don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon.